Come on, say it with me, okay? Strong girl. Strong girl. Strong curls. Strong girl. If you can do this, you can handle the world. You can handle this on the world. Growing up, so much of my identity as a black girl was my hair. So many of those sacred moments I shared with me and my mother were right there in front of those mirrors. Facing a lot of the things that, at the time, you're not prepared to face. I grew up in a small town surrounded mainly by white girls with straight hair and really trying to fit in. I was using products that were damaging my hair and my mom trying to do you know, the best that she could and times where you're really trying to figure out who you're going to be and so much of that was in my hair and those conversations me and my mother had in that mirror of what do you want to look like today? Who do you want to be? Who am I going to be going outside into that world? And so much of who I am really was spent grooming myself. And now being a mother, some of those times being hard for me to look at myself and really see who I was and for who I am and love myself. Being a black woman and having a black daughter now, I make sure every day my daughter knows that she is beautiful when she looks in that mirror, that she can talk to me when we look into that mirror, that she is going to be seen when she steps out into that world. And we have difficult times and struggles with our hair at times. It doesn't always do what we want it to do, and I want her to embrace those moments and know this can be tough. And sometimes in your day, the toughest thing will be brushing your hair. And sometimes the world will be ugly, but as long as you see who you are looking in that mirror, you can face anything that you would like to in this world. So that's what I would like to pass down to her is that being who you are, you know, as authentic as you want to be, but really embracing what makes you you and that really sometimes is just what grows out of you, which is your hair.